Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel where we talk about all things fragrance and things that smell amazing. If you are new here, my name is Sinead. Thank you so much for tuning in guys. Today I want to share with you a review on Jackie Ina's new sweater weather candle collection. So if you know anything about Jackie Ina, she is a amazing YouTuber that is basically flourishing in the candle world she has so many different collections she had one for valentine's day her like core collection one last year for winter and now this year she has come out with a fall collection so i went ahead and wanted to purchase them to share a review with you guys um first things first i got the minis so the mini is going to run you you get four of them and they're fifty dollars for like the mini set um i choose to get the minis only because i want to have the smaller versions before i commit to just one or four large candles this is just kind of like me trying it out to see what i like um if you want to get the bigger candles which about this you know this tall if you get four of them that's going to run you 143 dollars and if you want to just get them individually each one is 38 dollars but the mini set will just run you 50 dollars and you get to try out all four of them you know to see which one you like so let's go ahead and see what these are giving right now one thing i want to share with you the packaging so let's do this first um, you have the brown packaging and one thing I will say right here guys I can smell what's going on in here it's giving you know it's sweet it, it's a lot vanilla it's a lot going on so you're gonna get the packaging that goes like this at the top of it of course it all this one says it's cooling down but we're heating up all right Jackie you get the cloth that's going to be right here that's going to protect the candles and then you get the four that are right here so like i said they are the minis i wanted to try them out um the names are trickery sodom give me all of them and bait okay so let's see we're gonna go ahead and jump right into it and i'm gonna let you guys know the first one we are going to check out this one is trickery so one thing I do like is on, I'm not even sure if I showed you, so let me do that first. On the back of them, the back of the box, it tells you what the notes are of each individual candle. So I do like that as well. Each candle is 2.5 ounces with the burn time of up to 15 hours. And it lets you know the throw. So if it's bold or moderate, she will tell you on the back of the packaging. So I'm just going to read it from the back here. And they kind of give you my first impression. So this one is Trickery. Now Trickery is said to have the top notes of whipped butter, the heart note of caramelized sugar, and the base of sweet vanilla bean. Okay? And this one is said to have a moderate throw. And let's go ahead. So, alright. So look <laughs> at first smell. This reminds me of Play-Doh. That's just the first smell, okay? all right so i can kind of put my finger on it a little bit if you've ever had an apple cinnamon donut it kind of reminds me of that but at first i just put it here i was like oh play-doh but then i'm like that's not play-doh because it's spicy it smells like apple cider in a donut form like fluffy airy okay so it's definitely giving me some fall, but it is definitely sweet as well. I think that's where the sugar and then the caramelized and the whipped butter. So this is definitely sweet, but my opinion is kind of like an elevated vanilla candle. Like that's kind of what I'm getting from it. Mm, I'm going to be honest with you that that first sniff kind of throws me off. So I'm very interested in seeing how this will burn. It does say it's moderate. So let's just go ahead and just, we can only ask for that much the next one is thotum so t-h-o-t-u-m-n so thotum not autumn thotum i like what she did there because you know sometimes you want to be a thought i don't, I don't know to each his own <laughs> so thotum has pecans butter caramel corn the heart notes is sri lanka cinnamon and the base note is um vanilla i like how she just throws in stuff like why can't it just be cinnamon why i gotta be sri lanka <laughs> like i don't know but i just like how jackie does that like it's not just your vanilla 
we're gonna put a little bit more into it i like that so with um thottom it is said to have a bold throw okay so let's go ahead Ooh, i definitely smell the cinnamon at first sniff that is what i get immediately that cinnamon clove mm, it smells very spicy now i'm not sure now in my household when i was younger with my grandparents they used to have those cinnamon cloves that would just sit out that they might put like in the bathroom for like the guest bathroom now like you know how you had like the pine tree the pine cones but then you had the cinnamon cloves that it takes me back to my childhood when my grandparents did that brown sugar and cinnamon is kind of what i'm getting i don't know if that was even in here oh cinnamon yeah okay so yeah i'm kind of i'm getting it um to le to me it's a little bit much it's kind of making me like because i'm not a cinnamon person the sniff of cinnamon or the smell of cinnamon to me automatically makes me sneeze because it's just really overpowering just to me um i would definitely say don't put this in a close area if you're gonna get um like a big one of thottom i wouldn't put it in a small room i would definitely put it in the area where it's a large space because this can definitely overpower that area is it heavy yes i would just put this like in the living area or like the dining area never in a bedroom or if i did put this in my bedroom it would be like the doors are open i can't just close my door and put no there is no way um i don't really care for the cinnamon candles it, it gives me a headache like even now just reviewing it kind of makes my head hurt but i would say if you are a lover of cinnamon clove those type of scents or notes then you'll definitely love thottom okay the next one i'm going to share with you guys what's next give me all of them so it's give me and all of them like not all but olive like o-l-i-v-e mm, like give me all of them <laughs> so let's try this one has top notes of mandarin olive italian bergamot lemon balsam the heart notes is balas oh sorry wow lavender and mountain tulips and the base is sandalwood and amber and the throat is moderate on this one as well so ooh, yep this one is good this one i think i like this one a lot this one a lot is really really good it's not heavy like the other ones it's not heavy at all like thottom that's the one yep it's not heavy like that at all it's kind of fresh and citrus this is like a whole new like fall scent it's like a different take on a fall scent mm. it smells like a very clean spa i really really like like a green spa oh i like this this is really good um like i said it's totally different from the rest of them but the thing about this is I kind of understand why this is in the collection because I feel like any collection you have to gravitate or cater to the people who don't want heavy scents like this. So when you're thinking about the fall on the sweater weather, she of course she's kind of gravitates towards the fall, the heavy, but then you have to have something for people who don't like that but still want that fall vibe that they got going on. So of course you got the amber, like the mandarin, the olive. So the olive does give it a twist. I do like that. It's totally different i really like it i would definitely say this is like for a very masculine man but it's clean so for me this is like a neutral scent like you can have this in your home out of those two i just reviewed olive is definitely the more greener approach than the other two the other two were like cinnamon and then the other one was vanilla but this one is definitely like your clean fresh scent all right the next one I'm going to share with you guys in the last one. This is Baked and B-A-K-E-D. And with this one, it has the top notes of blueberry, rhubarb, the heart of cherry, strawberry, raspberry, and the base of vanilla. And the throat is moderate on this one. This is the last one. Oh, guys, and smelling this, this smells like a cherry pie that's just fresh baked out the oven. Definitely because i get those fruity notes like the strawberry the blueberry it's a blueberry a cherry any of those pies that you bring straight out the oven that's what this smells like so this is definitely giving fruity and like it says baked a baked good a baked pie wouldn't say cake because it's not fluffy enough but 
Would I get this in a full size? Yes. All of them? Yes. I would definitely say that. It's like a fruity, tart smell. It's like the right amount of tart and sweet, if you get what I'm saying. Yet it has a touch of warmthness to it that makes it like perfect for fall. Cause like, you know, when you're thinking of baking things, you're thinking of like Thanksgiving, Christmas is kind of winter, but you know, that time with your family, October, you're very family oriented or just like to bake. I know my family likes to bake, you know, pies and things like that, sweet potato pie, all those different pies for Thanksgiving, girl, you know. So I can definitely see this being in a fall collection because this one is giving baked goods, you know, pies. We're sitting down as a family. All of them is giving, you know, it's fresh, it's clean. I don't want to do too much, but I want my house to smell like pines or, you know, something like that. That's where this one comes in. Trickery. Oh gosh, this one is the vanilla one. So it's very sugary, very sweet. And then when you have the thottom, you definitely have the cinnamon. So if I had to pick out of any of them, which I would buy for full, it would be baked in all of them. I would definitely get a full size of them, but I can't wait to burn the rest of them just to see, because you know, when you're smelling something in a package, it can be different than when you're burning them. You can get a whole different experience. So if you have any of these from the new collection from Jackie Ina, let me know. Let me know what you think of them. Is there anything that I kind of, you feel is different? You know, I love to hear things in the comments section. If you like cinnamon, let me know. If you like the vanilla, if you weren't really feeling the olive in the candle, I want to hear about it as well. And I said, go check out the other candles that Jackie has. I have a lot of them. I have some full size. I still have some minis and I can't wait to burn these and see how the throw is on them. Okay, guys. So if you like the content that I gave to you today, please hit the like button down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you enjoy the vibe over here. You can follow me on Instagram at the style of sense guys. And until the next video, bye.